You might be surprised to find out that if it weren't for Napoleon, we might not have canned foods today. In 1800, during the Napoleonic Wars, the French government was looking for a new, inexpensive, and effective method for preserving large amounts of food. In 1806, a new preservation method would come from Nicolas Pair, a French chef who today is credited with inventing modern canning, or at least is considered to be responsible for developing the basis of modern canning. The technique that he used was to place food into specially designed glass containers, which were then sealed and placed into canvas bags. Glass containers would continue to be used until 1810, when Peter Duran patented the use of what were called tin plate canisters in Britain. While these containers would have roughly resembled the cans that we know today, they were definitely not identical. They were large, bulky, and sealed with lead solder, and had to be opened with a hammer and chisel, or smashed open with a rock. It wouldn't be until 1855 that the first can opener would be patented, while in the United States, the first can opener would be patented by Urza Warner in 1858. However, there wasn't a major demand for canned foods in the United States until the Civil War in 1861. So whether it's a glass jar, a steel can, or a foil pouch, we owe it all to Napoleon and Nicholas A. Pear. For more information, please visit sunup.okstate.edu or fapc.biz. Thank you.